In this video, we are going to discuss using JavaScript to create a simple image animation. In this document, up here we have an image, and that image changes every couple of seconds, creating an animation. Now let's look at the code that creates that animation. First of all, when our document is first loaded, here in our body tag, we have an onload attribute. That onload attribute executes something at load. And in this case, it executes this Java statement. It takes us our variable change images, sets it equal to the result of a sent set interval function. That set interval function will return a zero or one depending on whether it was successful or unsuccessful. The set interval function allows something to be executed at a given interval. So the set interval function will call the property add function that we have up here in our script tag. And it will call it every 2,000 milliseconds, which is two seconds. So every two seconds, property add is called. Now when our document is loaded, we create a variable called cur image. And we initialize that variable to cell one. Now when the document is first loaded, it calls property add. And in that function, the first thing we do is test cur image. We look at cur image, and if it is equal to cell two, which the first time through, it's cell one, so that is false. It goes down here to our else statement. Now, when the document is loaded, the browser creates an array with all the images in it. And it adds those images to the array based upon where they lie in the HTML. So the first image in the HTML document is in the images array at the zero index location. So right here, we go to our document, go to that first image, zero locations, and reset its source. Its source is now going to equal cell 2 JPEG. So it's going to change the image to cell 2. And then it changes our current image to cell 2. Now two seconds later, property add is called again. And we test. Well, if current image is equal to cell 2, which it is, we go to our document, that first image, and reset its source to cell1.jpg. So we change the image. And we change this cur image back to cell1. And that creates our animation. And that is how we use JavaScript to create an image animation.